Hi, my name is Hannah Green and I am getting baptized today um, because I really want other people to see what God has done in my life and um, yeah. Okay, um, so I grew up in a church home and um, my parents divorced when I was very young. So um, I was back and forth with them and back and forth between two different churches. So even though I was in this like Christian home, it was more of just very stressful. And um, as I got a little bit older, I was like six or seven, um, my older sister got baptized and um, I thought it was really cool. And so I was like, I want to do it too. And so I got baptized um, without knowing like this lack of personal relationship um, I, ha I didn't have with him, with, um, with God. And so all I had was his head knowledge. And so as I got um, a little bit older, um, a lot of tragic happened to my family um, through like sixth grade to like 11th grade. Um, I had a lot of bad things happen with death and um, just things here and there that were I was struggled with all the time. But then um, as I got older and understanding of like, like this head knowledge, um, I only had this head knowledge and I got understanding, I was teaching Sunday school and going on mission trips and seeing this lack of personal relationship. But then my best friend in high school, and she was, she was atheist and so her being atheist was a huge influence on me and because of that, I decided to just slowly walk away from Christ. Um, and at the same time, I was in a very unhealthy relationship and it just, m my heart for the Lord just faded. And I was like, it doesn't matter. I, you know, I need to think about me and only me and trying to find this happiness um, in this world. Um, and then as my senior summer came, I, um, I in this relationship, ended between um, me and this, this guy and it was very very unhealthy but at the same time at that moment I felt like everything that I was identified by was taken from me and um, and at the time I didn't realize that was like God's doing and then after that happened God took something else away and it was I tried to find myself in these things of this world I tried to find myself through going out and going out to parties with friends and um, doing all these sorts of things that were not healthy for me at all. And um, right before I um, went to college, about two weeks before I went to college, I just, I was sitting in my room and I looked at my room. I had just packed up for college and it was empty. It was dark. And all I could think was, this is like a representation of what my life looks like right now. And at that moment, I knew this lack of heart knowledge, this lack of personal relationship with God, was it, it was there, it was very evident. And so I opened my Bible and I sat there and I just laid everything that I had gone through and all these problems and all my struggles that I went through and I said, God, I give it to you. And I, um, right then and there was the moment um, I personally came to know Him. Yes, it's taken me 18 years to realize it, but it's never too late. And and through this, I realized that God is always sovereign no matter what.